even in a pandemic, hospitals are safe for all patients. No one health emergency rooms are prepared for all types of illnesses, but since the COVID-19 outbreak, the number of people coming in for emergencies has scaled back significantly. Here at Forsyth Medical Center, we've noticed a similar decline. We typically see about 250 patients a day in our emergency room, but that has decreased to an average of about 130 patients per day. Cardiologist Dr. Samuel Turner with No One Health. Statistics show that every 40 seconds an American has a heart attack. Says avoiding the emergency room because of fears over coronavirus could be a dangerous risk in the long run, especially for heart attack and stroke patients. Typically, once patients start having symptoms, we like to have them in the cath lab within 90 minutes so that we can open their artery up and restore the blood flow to the heart muscle. And just as short as 90 minutes can be the difference between surviving a heart attack or not. And time is a big factor in survival. Every minute that passes, portions of the heart muscle die. And so the sooner you come in, the more likely you're going to recover. But if you wait, you're going to have symptoms long term of heart failure. You may have problems breathing long term because of that. Some other doctors tell us they have even seen some patients die or lose limbs because they didn't get the treatment quickly enough. Dr. Turner says they don't want fear to supersede someone's overall health or chance of living. Our emergency room is doing an excellent job of protecting our patients from COVID-19. You know, there's certain areas where the COVID-19 patients are isolated. And if you're coming in with a heart attack or a stroke and you don't have symptoms of COVID-19, you'll be brought to a different area.